Hey, what is up everybody? My name is Thomas and welcome to our thoughts and predictions on the Nintendo Direct for Pokemon Sun and Moon and the yellow uh, announcement thing. I am joined today with none other than Tony Grind. Say hello. What up, y'all? What was that? What I was that? I thought you were going to introduce me. I didn't know you just... <laughs> what was that? You introduced me as Tony Grind, so I brought up a Tony Grind persona. <laughs> what up, y'all? <laughs> G freaking G. Anyways, so um, what we're going to be doing is we're going to first be talking about the Pokemon Yellow announcement, and then we're going to go on to Sun and Moon. So, um, I just got to first say that I am really hyped for Pokemon Yellow. I mean, I know it's already out, but... I'm really glad that it is out. Now, I do feel like that they shouldn't have announced it before the actual Direct itself. I mean, I get that they wanted to make the Direct a little bit longer, but honestly, I don't really feel like it was a great way to go about it. What do you think, Sulla? I feel, honestly, that the Direct was a waste because people have confirmed it 24 hours before the Direct. Yeah, same like what I think, because it was only five minutes as well, bear in mind. Yeah, so it, I bet you if people didn't leak it out the day before, it could have been longer. Yeah, and I also feel like people would have been a lot more hyped about it. Because um, it's like, Yellow got announced like, what were it, like two months before? And then Sun and Moon got announced like a couple of days beforehand. And it wasn't even by Nintendo. And the thing is as well, they didn't even announce that many new things about Pokemon Sun and Moon. Not I mean, yet. They I mean, just released Holiday 2016. I mean, it would have been a bit more worth it if they actually showed off some new Pokemon or whatever. But they didn't really do that. Well, think about it. Sun and Moon, who do you think the main characters are going to be? I think... Hmm. I think Team Rocket. Really? Yeah, really. I'm talking about, like, main Pokemon. Ah, oh, no, I wasn't on about that. I meant, like, just revealing new Pokemon in general. Oh, well, according to more pictures that have been released, it shows, like, they have a new Legendary or something like that. Oh, they actually have leaked some Legendaries. Not official, but they've showed off, like, just... It was just like a Pokemon that most people haven't seen before in that shape. It wasn't colored. It was. It didn't even have, like, that good of detail in the picture. Oh, so just like a little design, not yeah. like the final product. Yeah. So I was going to say, like, because at least they could have shown off even just a starter Pokemon. You know, like, because I think they did that with X and Y released, didn't they? Yeah. Something like that. When they was announcing. What was that? Is Chespin, Oshawa, and Tepi? No, that was black and white. I do not know X and Y that well. <laughs> I forgot who they were. Um, Chespin? Wait. No, no that's black yeah. and white. No. Yeah. Because they, and... they also came with Tepi and Froker. That's... Generation eh. that that's X and Y. No, that's not X and Y. No, no Tepig, Froki, and Chespin are X and Y. On X and Y stats. I'm actually googling this now. I'm googling it. <laughs> wow, we're actually do. Oh, you're right. <laughs> Wait, what were black and white then? It was. I'll figure it out. Wait, oh, black and white what? Oh, yeah, that's right. Snivy, Tepig, and Oshawott. Yeah. That's it. Oh, yeah, Finnegan. <laughs> I could forget about that guy. Anyway, move on. <laughs> Get back onto the subjects I had. We're so um, good at this. Yes, we are. Well, that would have only been like a two minute video if we didn't. Anyway, so. um, Something I would like to see for Pokemon Sun and Moon. What is something that you would like to see, Sully? Um, I want to see a bit more mega evolutions for Pokemon that people want, but don't have. 
Yeah, and something else that could be caused if we gave a Mega to some underrated Pokemon or, you know, something that could use a little bit of more love. Yeah, like uh, Mega Toxicroak. I would love that. Dude, that actually would work really good as a Mega. I would love that. That what would actually it? be really good. And the Mega Steelix? Yeah, Mega Steelix. <laughs> Do they have a Mega Machamp yet or no? Uh, not that I'm aware of, but like then, Mega Machamp, that could have been like eight arms or something like that. Dude, that like could actually rates. be one of the best. Dude, I actually just had a thought though what we could do for Video Wonder. What? A top ten Mega Evolutions that Pokemon needs. Alright. That would actually be really good. Hmm. I'm well, down to do it whenever you are. Well done, silly boy. You bought the video. Yay. Yay. I also really feel like they should, um, I highly doubt they would do it, but what I would like to see is if they, you know how with, uh, there's one game, I can't remember which one it was, Heart and Gold were it, where you could go back to the first generation, you know, Kanto? Yeah. After you completed Johto. No, yeah. Yeah, Johto. Um, I kind of hope that they do the same thing, but let us go back to something like Diamond and Pearl. You know, because Diamond and Pearl is kind of the underrated one. Um, maybe make it so Diamond and Pearl is a bit more reworked, because I will say the first bit of it at the start is kind of boring, but mm. I feel like that's something that they should do, but I highly doubt they would. Interesting. You know, like uh, we could catch like a plane back to Sinnoh. Yeah, that would be great. Or maybe take like, um, do like an underwater city. No, like, well, you have wait, to take a submarine to get to. Wait, if they do do that... Do-do. <laughs> <laughs> We're mature guys. If they put that feature in the game, <laughs> then do you think that could possibly, like, show off for a remake of it? Uh, what do you mean? Because it's a new game entirely. So they could add even like new Mega Pokemon if we are able to go back all the way. I, know, I wasn't on about that. I was on about like um, an underground city in Sun and Moon. Not the the of one, Sinnoh. I was talking about, talking? The, I was talking about the new region. They should add yeah, like an underground city. You set. said you also wanted it to bring back like uh... Yeah, but for like an after game. Oh, yeah. I feel like that's something that would be pretty cool. And like, to visit the underground city, you have to go to like, um, for like a submarine. And maybe there's even like a Pokemon underneath it that's exclusive to that one. You know what I mean? Yeah. I feel like that'd be really cool. And something that I would love to see is them do like a robot type of Pokemon. A robot type of Pokemon? Yeah. You know, they're running out of Pokemon, so eventually they're going to have no other choice. I mean, they have got, like, what, 749, is it? It's a yeah. lot. But I'll look, I would love to see, like, a robot one. And something that could be called as, like, a mega Pokemon. It could act like a Transformer. <laughs> it's like, they get, like, guns and stuff. It's really cool. But you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. I don't know if they completely do guns because well not like guns per se but you know what I mean because it's a children game and they don't want to promote violence and whatnot. well they did take out gambling because of that really they took out the slot machines how long has it been since you last played Pokemon <laughs> that's been out since like black and white really yeah I didn't play black and white completely. I did play through all of Y. I still have yet to beat Alpha Sapphire, and I had that for over a year. <laughs> I just completed mine recently. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I had mine well. for over one year. How long have you had yours? Uh, since it came out. <laughs> like, I've, I've only just gotten to complete it now. I think I'm at the fifth gym. Really? Yeah. God damn, I'm so late. <laughs> I know you're not really the silly Absol much anymore, but 
Damn. Oh god. That's why I'm Dude. hesitant about buying the new Pokemon game. Oh, because you think you'll never even touch it once you've yeah. completed it. <laughs> so, like, I really want to get Sun and Moon. I mean, like I want to. I don't know which one I'm gonna get yet, because when it was Pokemon X and Y, I got Y, Alpha Sapphire, Omega Ruby. I got Alpha Sapphire. Until more details comes out about each version, then I'm not sure. I know some people have been doing it as kind of like a joke kind of thing, but I guarantee Nintendo are going to put Solrock and Lunaton as the mascots of the game. Yeah. How much you want to bet that? Because if they don't do that, then that's a missed opportunity right there. If they do that, that would be good, but if they don't do that, that means they'd have to put in a new legendary for the mascot of the game. Yeah, but the thing is, if they don't do that, that's also a missed opportunity. You know, and they could even give, like, mega evolutions to them if they hadn't already. So I don't think they have. I'm just going to Google that now. What? If they've got a mega, like, Soul Rocket and uh, Lunatad. Not that we know of. Uh, I honestly can't but, remember. But then again, we're a Pokemon noob, so... No, we're definitely... There's definitely no mega. Although I'm seeing, like, a really funny picture right now. <laughs> Mega Lunatone, the moon from Majora's Mask. And then yeah. Mega Soul Rock, the baby face from Teletubbies. <laughs> <laughs> that is actually brilliant. I'm going to post that on Twitter. But, like, seriously, they really should do that. That'd be great. I would love it. Um, And something else that I would love to see, right, is I really wish they did this for Alpha Sapphire as well. Um, If they put in the Acro Bike and the Mot Bike. Give us the ability to have both bikes. You know, just like, maybe for the second bike we have to buy it or something. Wait, d didn't we also get, like, roller skates in one game? Uh, I think we got that in X and Y. Something like yeah, that. why don't they also give us that? That way we can choose. To be honest, I would actually prefer a skateboard. A skateboard? Yeah, you think that'd be really cool. It's like skateboarding it would, around the town. but I don't see... Yeah, I would agree, but I don't see how it would work out. I mean, they could put, like, just for fun, like, a skate park, but, like, um... Because you got some really good skaters out there that can just, like, skate uphill and stuff. Yeah. Or maybe they could just put, like, an alternate way to get up places. You know, instead of, like, a slope. I'll give us the ability to have both of them. You know what I mean? Yeah, and then that way we can only switch between which ones we want. Yeah, and, like, um... The thing is, as well, right? Maybe we could take out the running shoes and replace it with a skateboard. Because we can't run inside anywhere. Yeah. Um, but other than that, though, is there anything else that you really feel like they should add in? Um, I mean, me personally, I would love also to see, even though it's a long shot, I would actually like to see them implement, like, some sort of arcade. You know, it's like an alternate thing for the gambling system not being in there anymore. Maybe do, like, an arcade oh. machine just for fun. Yeah, like an arcade machine where it can, like, take you, like, the game is older games and you have to do, like, a short battle, something like that. Yeah, something like that. Or, like, um, you know how they've got the pinball game on Windows 7? Yeah. Maybe do that, but, like, a Pokemon version. I think they've got Pokemon Pinball, but, like, they should I would add love that to say into that. the game. Yeah, they should just do, like, a bunch of mini games in general, and... The thing is, as well, what they could do is do, like, a thing where, um, if you get, like, a certain amount of points or whatever during the games, then you can use them to buy TMs or, uh, proteins and stuff like that. Yeah, isn't that what they did with the gambling? Yeah. It's just, like, the substitute. Interesting. I would actually love to see that. Um, but other than that, one last thing I'd like to see is maybe do something like they did with... The dressing up Pikachu in Alpha Sapphire and Omega Ruby. But do it for like starters or something. One last thing I would like to see is a Mega Star Raptor. Mega Star Raptor? Yeah. Oh yeah, just give him like armor or something. Yeah. Hmm. Dude, because yeah. he's honestly. Like, all the Pokemon I listed off Machamp, Toxicroak, Star Raptor, those are some of my favorites. That need mega evolutions. 
Yeah, they were actually really cool. And one more Pokemon that should get a Mega. Rebecca's gonna be happy. Mega Chikorita. I swear to the Lord above I got rid of that phone. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know how long that's been in here. <laughs> it's been in here the first day we got it and I told my mom I did not want it. She removed it for like a few weeks and put it back. <laughs> And ever since it. then, I did not want it. I'm not even removing this from the video. I'm just going to keep it in. Like, you should ask Brian and Cliff. I'll be, we'll be in the middle of playing Minecraft and stuff. <laughs> and boom, phone goes off. <laughs> I'm keeping this in the video. It's not funny. <laughs> you don't know how much it bothers me. <laughs> anyway, dude. I'm going to go ahead and end this video off. Uh, yeah, anything else you got to say? So <laughs> uh, I hate home phones. Oh, God. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. If you did and you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. And if you're feeling really daring, press the like button. Other than that, thanks for joining me, Sully. You're welcome, Thomas. Thanks for watching, and I shall see you in the next video. Oh yeah, one more thing. Look out for Thursday, because the 100th episode of Minecraft Survival will be going up. I've just finished and rendering that now. I'm going to be watching every second of it. You will be doing. I am. Are you going to, like... I'll talk to you after the video. Yeah. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye, Nintendo crew. You still call them that, right? Should I stop the recording?